weather I know And so let's go Get in the flow I'll teach you whether you'll say Whoa, do the Tia twist Cause you're hanging with the meteorologist Hi kiddos, I'm Tia Tornado Today's Tia topic How to make your own thermometer Do the Tia twist with me And we'll head to the weather lab here we go! Woohoo! We made it! Welcome to the weather lab. The sign for thermometer is this. So, anytime I say thermometer, make this sign. How do you think we make a thermometer? Let's take a look. Here are all the supplies you will need to make your own thermometer. Tape, an index card, a clear straw, modeling clay or Play-Doh, a clear bottle, food coloring, water, and rubbing alcohol. First, fill your clear bottle almost halfway with water. Next, add about the same amount of rubbing alcohol to the bottle. So it's about two thirds full. After that, fill up the bottle with about five drops of food coloring. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. Then give the bottle a little swish. Ooh. Then take your clear straw and put it inside of the bottle, making sure that some of the straw is inside of the water while the other part of the straw is outside of the bottle. Take your modeling clay or Play-Doh and wrap the Play-Doh around the straw, covering up the hole at the top of the bottle. Make sure you get that Play-Doh on really good you don't want any holes showing on the other side of the bottle. So it looks like this. And this is the final step to make your own thermometer. Take your index card and flip it vertically like this. Then make about half inch marks all the way to the top of the index card. Here we go. There we go. So it looks something like this. Then take your index card and put it behind your straw on top of your Play-Doh. You can take a piece of tape and tape the index card onto the straw by wrapping the tape around the straw like this. And there we go. We have our very own thermometer. Go ahead and put this outside. What you'll notice is the water and alcohol mixture will go up the straw when it starts to get warmer and down the straw when it starts to get cooler. You can even take it a step further by writing the numbers of what the temperature is next to these lines. So how would you do that? Well, first, you'd want to put this outside for about 30 minutes. After about 30 minutes, you'll notice the liquid will go up the straw and stop. Go inside and ask an adult what the temperature is. 
that's where the line stops. So you'd write the temperature right next to the line where the liquid stops. From there, you'd be able to calculate the temperature. So when it gets warmer, it'll go above that temperature, and when it gets cooler, it'll go below that temperature. That's it for today. We're all done with this show. Do the Tia twist, because it's time to go. I hope you had fun. I'll see you real soon. Until next time, keep dancing to your favorite tunes.